Greetings everyone. Today we will address the issue with the Rosalind compiler used by ASP.NET applications for code compilation in Visual Studio. The error indicates Visual Studio can't locate the csc.exe file within the bin Rosalind directory of the project, which is essential for compiling C-sharp code during the build process. Roslyn is a .NET compiler platform by Microsoft, which provides compilers for C-Sharp and VB.NET, along with APIs for code analysis. CSC.exe represents the compiler in the Roslyn platform, which compiles source code into machine code. These are some potential causes of the error. Remember to clean and rebuild solution after every fix. Restart the Visual Studio if necessary. Clean and rebuild your solution. In some cases, batch build is more helpful. Close Visual Studio and delete files from the bin, VS, OBJ, and Packages folders. Relaunch the Visual Studio and rebuild the solution. In Solution Explorer, right-click the project and select Unload Project. Then, right-click the unloaded project and choose Reload Project. This will recreate any missing or broken project dependencies. The first two packages are compatible with applications created in older versions of the .NET Framework and Visual Studio. Right-click the project and select Manage NuGet Packages. Here you can install the packages if missing. Update to the latest version. Downgrade to a working version. Or reinstall the packages. To perform a forceful update, open the Package Manager console and execute the displayed command. Ensure the Roslyn folder is included in your project. If the Roslyn folder does not exist in the bin folder, copy it from another created project. If the compiler is not created in the default Roslyn folder, add a target of copy Roslyn files in the project file. To ensure that the package's MS build content has been imported before building, add the target. Ensure new get package build imports in the project file. Add the post build event property group to verify the existence of Roslyn folder. Change the target.net framework. Reload project. Finally, rebuild the project. Search the entire solution for the faulty packages and remove their references.
open the project file, and remove the import tags of the packages. In the web config file, comment or remove the code DOM tag. Now, uninstall compilers using the Manage NuGet Packages tool. You can also uninstall the compilers using Package Manager Console. Subscribe for more videos like this.